way you are feeling, you are thinking, that you might be right, because you are welcomed. Welcome on earth. So that's, I think, to deal with beauty, to deal with images, to understand that this is a cultural impulse. Everything comes from the culture. And then to, to go by your own culture. That I think you can do. And uh, I think we'll have one more question uh, before the panel. Uh, since the Swiss referendum failed, how long does it take? Are you planning to do another referendum in Swiss Switzerland? So we can do it the day after. <laughs> it's okay, we can do it. And Daniel wanted to do it the same again, everything exactly the same. Um, but after the referendum, so 23% of the voters voted in favor for an unconditional basic income. The majority rejected it. But you know, 23% is nearly every four of the citizens are in favor for such a total risk idea. So that's immense. That's really beautiful. It's a big, big thing. And we've got so many yes votes by the conservatives with people. And the next referendum depends on when the people are there, when the forces are there. So you cannot say, we will do it then. It depends on if there are people who are going with us. It depends on when we feel or taste that the time is at the right point. I guess eight years. Let's give a round of applause to Mr. Schmeckman. Okay, up next, Ina will actually continue to speak in a moment. Um, we're going to have a panel discussion with representatives from Australia, uh, Korea, Taiwan, China, and Switzerland. Um, and we will talk about the prospects for the basic income in the Asia Pacific. So if I can have someone set up uh, five, five chairs. Uh, we have a volunteer. Okay. Yeah, if we, we yeah, right here is okay. 